If you're going to college and you can't decide what major to choose, watch this video. So I made another video talking about the four majors that I don't think make sense, or maybe it was five. Um, just to clear a few things up, psychology without furthering their education still makes no sense to me. The other degrees, I said what I said, I'm not reviewing those. There were a bunch of people who saw that video and got upset, and of course the people who were upset were the ones who chose those majors, so you know, it makes sense, it's okay. But there were also people who were saying they just don't know how to choose their majors, so I wanted to make this video. A lot of people who went to college and majored in things that they ended up not liking chose those majors because their parents told them to or they watched a video of some girl online saying choose this major or don't choose this major. It's really important when you're choosing your major to think of yourself, okay? As I always say on my platform, use other people's videos and information to inform you but not to decide your career path or your life path in general. There are three main questions you're gonna ask yourself when deciding your major. The first question is gonna be what interests you? Write this down, get a pen and paper out, write it down. Write down the topics that you study, write down fields that you see people working in that you find interesting, whether it's psychology, whether it's public health, whether it's film and TV, whether it's writing, whether it's marketing, communication, social media, doesn't matter, write it down. Now that you've written down the things that you're interested in, the second thing you're gonna do is you're going to decide the kind of lifestyle that you want. You know yourself better than anybody else. So if you want a modest lifestyle, you want a simple life, write that down. If you want a lavish lifestyle, write that down and be honest with yourself, please. If you're the kind of person that loves to shop, that loves to buy things, if you are a consumer at heart, admit it to yourself, okay? If you're a consumer at heart, understand that you want a certain type of lifestyle. Do you want to buy a house? Do you want to have kids? Think about the kind of life that you may want. And the last question that you're going to ask yourself slash the last thing that you're going to do, there's a lot of research involved with these, with these steps. The last thing you're going to do is you're going to look at the topics that you're interested in and research different job titles. Okay. And then you're going to pair that with the lifestyle that you have said you want. You're going to look at these job titles and these different topics that you're interested in and look at the average salary. I actually did this for nine random majors. The link is still in my bio. It's completely free. It's this document where I put together different job titles for certain majors. I also put statistics on income and out, you know, different income stats to help people inform themselves on the kind of major they want to major in based on the kind of life that they want to have. So when you do all those steps, you're going to come together with this final list of jobs that fit the lifestyle that you're interested in, as well as your interests. Another thing I want to note is a college degree is not a life sentence, my friends. Just because you major in one thing and that's where you may be getting your main income from for the first like five to ten years of your professional career doesn't mean it's going to be your only source of income. Doesn't mean it's going to be the only thing you're doing in your life. It's just a stepping stone.